yes guys yes people welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video thank the lord thank the lord we left that ground with three points because for a long period of that game it didn't feel like we were doing that that was scary nervous all of the buzzwords you can think of but we managed to scrape it at the end and it does feel like a scrape because we were not the better team Yet again, against the bottom four, we seem to absolutely struggle. Yet again, we seem to struggle against a low block. Yet again, we struggle on set pieces and corners. Yet again, we struggle in transition. And this is why I was not getting overly gassed about the manager in the last two and a half games. Because that did not look like the last two and a half games. And we played a much simpler team to play than the other two. Spurs, West Ham, light work. Nottingham Forest, not really for us. But credit to Pochettino where it's deserved. The substitutions were the right substitutions. And they helped us come back into the game and eventually win it. That's it. In terms of structure, we pushed Palmer onto the left, which kind of disjointed our attacking play. The Cucurella inverted situation was neutralized. Because they just kept swarming him in the first half. And yet again, we looked clueless. Against a low block, we struggled again. Set pieces, we struggled again. We got beaten transition a lot. Kind of got very lucky with some of the chances that um, Forrest had. They hit the post like two, three times. Chris Wood misses a bigger sitter than the two he missed against Manchester City. So we got out of jail a lot. But the substitutions were correct. So I'm going to give Poch credit for that. Like, Gallagher had to come off earlier, if anything, but he came off. Sterling comes on, gets a goal. Gusto comes on, helps. James comes on, gets an assist. And that's honestly the difference between this game, Sheffield United and Burnley. Just quality off the bench. And that is what worries me. Because if we need the quality to just get us out of jail like that, that's a bit of an indictment on the manager. It's a little bit of an indictment on him, but like it wasn't just him. Like attackers were poor. Nonny was left isolated all game. Jackson had a hall of shame performance. Like he was awful. Didn't even do the fundamentals correctly in this game. He all he just got was a header at the end. That was it. Like in terms of like pure quality, like I'm just looking at Caicedo, if anything. He was unbelievable, especially in that second half. He was absolutely sourcing. Got one assist, got a pre-assist, probably should have had another two or three. But that that's about it in terms of this game. Like I'm I'm happy with the drive. I'm happy with the game management, which to be honest is a positive in itself, because we don't usually get a lot of good game management over here. We usually get worse as the as the game progresses. Past that, not great. Not great. But this was also our toughest test, if anything, just because of our away record. Like, our away record's not been good. Well, that was our first win in, like, five or six games, something along the lines of that. So I'm glad that we beat that duck, at least. Um, but we were very slow in moving the ball forward. Transitional phases we absolutely struggled in. Players were looking selfish again in the final third, and that's something that they do need to improve on. Jackson was ignoring Mudrick in so many um, for so many opportunities, and Mudrick was actually making the right runs, but Jackson was trying to do hero ball, just like trying to beat two or three players in a row like he's prime Eden Hazard. You aren't that guy, respectfully. I know you're better with your fundamentals, but still, you're not that guy. Let's not try that. Let's not try that. But we won. Thank the Lord. And we take this to Brighton, which is going to be another like um, hockey match. Just give me a second. I need to put this fan cam up. But yeah, we, we got another hockey match coming up again on Wednesday. Brighton's Cup final. That one's going to be end to end, which kind of suits us a little bit more. So hopefully we look a lot better in that match. But I'm not deluding myself into thinking that this is any um, turned corner by the manager. I just think he made the right substitutions. And past that, it weren't a good game from him. Especially for someone who's been talking all the noise that he's been talking this week. I expected a lot better. A lot better. But yeah, big up to everybody that's locked in anyway. 
hit the like button, subscribe, all of that crap. Let me know all your thoughts down in the comment section below. Potch out still. And let's go get six points. Up the Chelsea.